Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Chantel Suarez and this is my voice, three months on testosterone. Who am I? The truth is, I really don't know. Until May 31st, 2018. Mark of my second puberty. I grew up knowing that there's only men and a woman. Growing up, I felt different, weird, and scared. I think I don't belong with this body. At first, I was confused. Too many questions. I tried to fight the feelings inside. But it is a war I kept fighting. And I keep on losing. Until I stop fighting and start accepting. Then I found my true self. The self that is happy. The self who accepts myself. I found me. The search is over. I am my own man. It was blurry at first, but now it's clear as crystal. Today, August 31st, 2018, I can't believe I am three months on testosterone, a step closer to the man I have always been. I'm Chantel Suarez, and this is my voice, pre-testosterone. Hi, I'm Chantel Suarez, and I am one month on testosterone. Hey, my name is Chantel Suarez, and I am two months on testosterone. Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Chantel Suarez, and this is my voice, three months on testosterone. Keep for watching the introduction video. I did it on purpose because this is the first time that I will reveal that I am on testosterone. I have never been happier in my life. So let's proceed to the changes. So for the three months, I gained um, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of acne, like in my forehead, in my face, and especially at my back here and my shoulders. As you can see, there's the acne are really crazy because testosterone makes your face and body really oily. So that's actually the reason why and next muscle strength I gained muscles as you can see here and I like it like I don't do too much workout it's it's just there it's due to testosterone and of course the most visible change for me is my voice as you can see in that comparison video my pre t pre testosterone until today my voice is it's just became darker and darker and i like it so far the change that i don't like is just the acne and hair growth um i don't really come from a family with more hairs like it's not really in our genes but i i'm starting to see like just tiny bits but, well, you can see the camera isn't making, making any justice right now. But as you can see, my eyebrows here, I don't know how much percent is it for testosterone because I am using castor oil and I'm done with castor oil. I'm now shifting to minoxidil. And bottom hair growth is crazy. I live in there, so it's crazy. And appetite. Well, even before I took testosterone, I had a crazy appetite, and it's crazier than crazier right now. Not that I am taking testosterone. So, for those of you who are still thinking if you're gonna take testosterone or not, or if you're gonna start testosterone, always consider the risks that it's gonna make to your body. And make sure that you consult your doctor or your chronologist. Well, in my case, I am just so lucky to find a provider here in Chicago, uh, Howard Brown. They are super nice and very accommodating. And always consider that it is safe. And I'm 
sorry, I'm really bothered with my hair right now because I did this on purpose because like my family didn't know yet that I am on this process of transitioning and that I will deal later on but for now uh, I'm taking care of myself this is still me and I am happy oh 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 before I forget another change that it made me was my emotional change like I get really irritated easily but it's something that I can handle so that's it I'll see you guys in my fourth month update on testosterone please hit like and subscribe thank you for watching have a great day